Assalamualaikum semua. My name is Farzana from L'Oreal and today we are in uh, Lazada's office to uh, shoot a makeup tutorial for this coming Raya. So uh, there'll be a few tutorials that I'll be doing. So the first one will be a really, really soft day look which you could achieve within 20 minutes max. Alright, so before I even jump into the uh, makeup, I would like to emphasize on how important your skincare is in the morning because kita mesti dah berpuasa untuk sebulan, our skin is so dehydrated, so it's so essential that we make sure that our skin and you know, we look really really fresh on our raya day. So before I even start with the makeup, I can cleanse my skin. I did that before with the Hydra Fresh Genius. This is a uh, multi-active genius foam. So this is really good for those of you with dry or dehydrated skin. Uh, as for me, this is really, really effective because my skin is so dry and so dehydrated at the moment. Okay, so I dah clean tadi. I dah clean tadi. Jadi next, I nak kena uh, clean my eye areas sebab takut ada apa-apa leftover makeup from uh, you know previous couple. So I'm going to use the Garnier Micellar Water. Now this is such a genius product sebab dia tak ada sabun, tak ada apa. It's just like a really, it's, it's just like water. So what you do is you just place it around your eye area couple for some time and I just massage and just remove any extra bits that you have left. So this is so important guys sebab kalau tak nanti makeup kita akan bercampur and you know whatever you have before this pun akan show up. So you don't want that to happen so make sure you really really clean your skin. Okay? So I've had like you know extra bits of makeup removed now okay uh, once i da clean my skin dengan the micellar water i na i'm gonna use this hydra fresh genius water so what this does is just gonna lock in the moisture in my skin as i said it's so crucial that you focus on you know moisturizing your skin and making your skin hydrated again so just a few drops of this just with the palm Sort of give yourself like a mini facial in the morning. Just pamper yourself early morning. You know, it's not gonna be, it's not gonna take up too much time. Because kita pun tak ada masa pagi-pagi. Here you gotta get ready and stuff. So I think this small steps will really, really make a huge impact nanti. Okay. So once kita dah uh, apply that water, I can apply moisturizer now. This will actually just ensure that the moisture, uh, the moisture in my skin is going to last throughout the day, because it's a long day we're talking about. So you really, really need to make sure that everything is in place. And I don't want my makeup to crack. That's very important, especially kalau kita skin yang dehydrated. Uh, our skin tend, to, uh, the makeup tends to crack throughout the day, sebab tak cukup moisture kan. So make sure we carry out the steps. Just doing that already makes me feel so much fresher. Alright, now, uh, normally for me, throughout the day, I can clue up, you know, we'll visit people. So, it's so important that I actually apply UV skincare on my skin sebab I tak nak, you know, I want to prevent myself from getting, you know, I don't want the sun at this point. <laughs> Alright, so this is the L'Oreal UV Perfect City Resist. Uh, I suka benda ni sebab dia is quite moisturizing tapi it's not oily and it really really does protect the skin. I've been using this for quite some time. And you really really need the tiniest amount of this, tak payah banyak. Because kalau kita apply banyak nanti takut nanti dia akan ada uh, flash on uh, the camera when we take picture kan sebab dia ada UV. Okay, so now that's as far as skincare will go. Um, next, we want the makeup to last throughout the day, so I can apply the L'Oreal True Match Blur Cream. Now, um, I've got really, really large pores, so it's so important that I apply this. Sebab kalau tak nanti, it's just gonna, you know, my pores is gonna be emphasized. Just a little bit of this. 
Oh ya, yeah. also to mention before I even start lepas ada mandi rambut semua uh, sebab I'm going to wear my hijab throughout the whole day and I tak nak rambut I akan ada bau masam ke apa. So I always always get some oil, you know, some sort of hair oil on my hair just to protect my my my, my hair. So this is the Elsif extraordinary oil. What well, they call it the pink oil rather. So this is so good guys. This smells incredible. So you just need like two pumps of this, you know, I'll just rub some, you know, on my palms and I'll just brush it through my hair and then you know I'll wear my hijab as usual so what this does is that lepas ada buka tudung I pun at least rambut I masih akan lembut and it will still smell incredible so uh, this is something that I will not skip every morning even if I want to go to work ke apa pun I make sure I akan pakai benda tu juga ok so I dah letak primer Uh, lepas primer, I nak letak my foundation as usual. So, I'm using the infallible Stay, Found Stay Fresh foundation. Um, foundation ni uh, promises to stay on your skin for 24 hours and I kind of did the test juga. It really, really works. It really, really lasts so long on your skin. It really, really uh, promise, you know, keeps up to its promise. So, one pump of that. We're going to start with one pump first. If you need extra, then, we, you know, we can just add up later. So, I akan guna beauty blender untuk blend sebab I tak nak heavy coverage sangat. So, when I use the beauty blender, it's so important that I, you know, dab it on my skin instead of pushing it because when I push it, I'm not really, you know, depositing the product on my skin. So, just, just dab the product on your skin. And remember that foundation is not supposed to uh, cover everything. It's just supposed to even out your skin. So do not you know, attempt to cover every pimples on your skin dengan foundation because it's not going to work like that. You're just going to end up looking like a, a clown. So this is one pump of foundation. So if you need extra, then you just ambil lagi sikit je And then just apply mana yang kita perlu ke, perlu je Sebab you tak payah apply semua tempat kalau you tak perlu Okay So as for me, I can stop sini dulu I tak nak apply further Sebab I think it has given me quite, uh, you know, nice coverage And I still have concealer and stuff So, you know, do not overdo your foundation daripada awal Takut nanti at the end, it's just going to look too heavy on your skin So, I ada masalah dark circles and pigmentation. So, it's so important that I correct my skin. This is the um, NYX Conceal Correct and Contour Camouflage Palette. Uh, I really, really like this sebab senang. I have all the colors in. So, I just have to mix and match for my skin tone. Tak payah susah-susah beli macam-macam. Alright. So, for this, I akan take the peachy shade ni. I'm just going to apply that underneath my eyes. Nah, kalau you tak ada uh, pigmentation problem, uh, lucky you, you can skip this step. Tapi kalau macam I, you got, you guys have, you know, quite deep dark circles, and then this step might, might, might really come in handy. So I'm just taking some with my brush, and then I'm just blending it dekat area mata I. So a little bit on my eyelid juga, sebab I've got quite uh, dark circles kat sana. So already, can you see not beza sini dengan sini? It looks much more brighter and I tak conceal lagi. This is just correcting, okay? So blend this really well. So this palette actually comes in a few shades. So uh, for my skin, I would use this color. So if you guys are darker ke, lighter ke, you know, choose colors accordingly. Uh, you need to make sure that the undertone of the uh, character suits your skin. Macam I, I got quite yellow skin. So those sort of peachy shades will really, really work well on me. So the same shade, I nak letak ke area my, my uh, lip area. Now, the key to this is really just blending. So, the more you blend, the more uh, invisible it looks. But I understand it's supposed to be a 20 minutes look, so you got to just fast forward everything. Okay?
So I think just by doing this pun I dah rasa I, I look you know much more awake. My eye area looks much more fresher. And of course lepas ni kalau I letak apa-apa eyeshadow pun it will, it's just going to show up better on my skin sebab dah tak ada dark circles dah. So I dah correct. Uh, now you kena conceal sebab you can actually just leave it this way tapi I really want more light and more uh, freshness underneath my eyes so I am going to go in with a concealer this is the instant age rewind concealer from Maybelline now um, I rasa I tak payah cerita lagi kot pasal benda ni I think it's everybody's favorite it really really works it's so lightweight I'm going to use this as an highlighter sikit eh. So this is just going to give me some extra coverage. As I said tadi kan, jangan letak banyak sangat foundation because there's still concealer. Now, what concealer does is that walaupun orang akan kata sama je, baik letak foundation je, I save out on concealer. But not really, sebab concealer punya pigmentation uh, lain, the pigments in concealer is much more compact. Jadi, uh, you know, it's not like uh, foundation, it's not as, you know, pigmented as concealer. So when you apply too much, then you you know areas that, that yang you tak perlu pun you can apply a lot of pigments which you don't need. Like concealer, you can target where you need it. Okay, so dah habis concealing. Uh, I want to put back some shades on my skin sebab, you know, I've actually covered everything up. So, it's so crucial that I bring back my my jawline sikit yang tak berapa sangat. So, I can guna, this is the uh, Maybelline We Face Dual Stick. So, dia ada both contour and highlight. So, contour, you got to put wherever you want to, you know, uh, you want to reduce or you want to recite your shadows. Okay, so what you do is you just suck your cheeks in. And then you just follow the hollow of your cheekbones. Do you see that? Alright. Okay, I also not recite my, my nose sikit sebab I want it to look much more slim. Slender rather. It's just colour. Just, just draw this look at the sides and I also want to you know make this part appear smaller I also want to have make sure that my lips look quite pouty and also I've got double chin can't blame us doing raya right so I then apply some more too and then with the concealer with the highlighter shade I can just letak dekat wherever you know where I want to highlight so got my tips in this case in this case, keep it small skin. Alright? So now you're going to look like a clown for a while. But that's okay. You're going to blend everything in. So when you blend, you're going to blend the uh, light shades dulu, okay? Sebab nanti kan our beauty blender akan ada dark shades. When you blend dekat the lighter parts, nanti dia akan keluar lah kat sana. And so always blend the lighter shades first. And if there's one thing that I would uh, suggest is focus on your skin first. You know, when your skin looks good, everything else will just fall in place without you even trying hard. Okay, so bagi yang berhijab macam I, jadi we tak payah risau pasal our contour line kat bawah ni sebab we're not going to show that. But let's say if you're not wearing hijab, so you might want to carry the uh, contour shade just along your uh, jawline sikit just to make it look more prominent. Okay, kalau you all pakai tudung, I think the tudung itself will just, uh, you know, help you in that. Okay, so kita dah blend semua. Now, take a mirror really close and just see if there's any sharp edges you know you really want everything to look as blended as possible shouldn't look like you've used a lot of contour all right so once you're happy with your blending you can set some of this by you know everything stays on place so uh, I really want I've got really dry skin so I'm not gonna put too much of powder sikit je I'm not gonna this next uh, no filter finishing powder 
So it, it's supposed to give you the effect of macam you know you tak ada filter but your skin looks so smooth and it really really does look smooth. So just a little bit of that underneath my eye socket. I not, I, I'm not going to do any baking ke apa sebab number one I don't think so we have that much time to do baking or what. And number two really really um, I've got quite dry skin as I mentioned jadi macam for me it really doesn't work. But if you rasa macam you nak buat baking ke apa, you could just take this, use your beauty blender ke or any, you know, sponge and then just go really heavily and then, you know, dab it underneath your eyes. That works. Alright, so now I've set the skin. So now when I touch pun, it's, it, nothing really comes out of my fingers. Okay, uh, next I nak buat uh, my kening dulu. Now, I got quite dark kening, jadi I tak akan overdo my kening, otherwise I'm going to look like a sinchan. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to get a brush. Okay, this is actually the fashion brow pomade crayon from Maybelline. Uh, I'm just gonna just gonna go in first just to get the initial shape. Now it's okay if you uh, you you do any mistake dekat kening ke apa sebab I selalu akan conceal area kening I. I'm gonna show you that in a while. So this is really, really great color. You're in a rush, you know, you really just want to do some impact. No, you're not kening tapi tak ada masa, just use this color on your kening. But had it been you had the masa sikit pagi tu, just grab a brush and then now you can actually draw in your, your you know, individual hair strokes. Okay, just focus and just draw wherever you need. So I said, this is really optional. If you've got really, really nice eyebrow, you could skip this step all in. But let's say, kalau you know, you want to take in the extra effort or brow is your thing, you know, just, just do this extra steps. Okay. So, dah buat tu, it's, uh, you know, tak kisah kalau dia messy ke apa, I can easily conceal everything that I, you know, whatever that I nak, nak hide. So, just grab a brush. The same concealer yang kita guna tadi. Scrap some on the brush. Just really just clean it. So what this will do is that you know, kalau kita ada you know those stray hairs around there, we'll just make it look less visible. already that looks much more polished can you see Alright, so lepas kita dah buat tu, kalau ada masa, you know, you you can just go in again with your uh, pomade and color in wherever that you think, you know, okay, you want to have extra. Okay, alright, done. So next, I nak buat uh, my eyeshadow. Eyeshadow is so simple, guys. It's really, really not going to take up much time. Because as I said, I really want to make sure that everything is done within an induced period of time. But of course, when you do your tutorial kat rumah, you tak akan cakap banyak macam I sekarang. So you'll have more time. So I can guna, this is the uh, Ultimate Shadow Palette from NYX. I'm just using this purple color. Sikit je. So I'm just going to use that all over my eyelid. Now I'm just going to take the lighter shade which is uh, just beside the purple, this colour, the same brush, just taking a 
tons of that. I'm just going to load that on my brush. And I'm going to apply it at the inner corner. I'm also going to carry that look just bawah mata sikit. Okay. Alright, then uh, just taking another brush sebab I nak shade. Okay, especially kalau siapa yang tak ada double eyelid tu, you kena, you really got to do this step just to make sure macam nampak, you know, the shape to your eyes. Just taking the darker shades from the palette. So, you could use either this one or this. I'm mixing both. So just taking some on the brush. Just I'm just going around the crease area. So nampak tak? Immediately this one looks like, you know, I have a deeper eye, so eye socket. So blending it up here. Okay. Okay. Next, I nak apply uh, mas uh, before mascara. I actually have to apply eyeliner dulu. So, but you know, you have you you would have the light shade. So, I really want to frame back my eyes. So, this is the Hyper Ink Liquid Liner from Maybelline. Okay. So, I'm just gonna get some. I'm going to put the, uh, my mirror really low so that I can see what I'm doing. I tak nak wing the eyes ke apa sebab as I say, I don't think so we have time to wing the eyes in the morning. So what we're trying to do is just, you know, make sh making sure that there's impact. But if, I, you know, winging your eyes is your thing, then go ahead. I'm just going to finish it off that way. Okay. Just wing it slightly just so I'm not going to pull, I'm not going to do anything dramatic. Okay, so dah buat tu. Uh, I'm just going to do the other eyes sebab I nak tunggu dia kering. I'm not done with the eyes yet. Can you all see? I hope you guys can. Okay, so dah letak eyeliner. Now, uh, I tak pernah suka eyeliner yang really, really sharp. So normally, I dah letak eyeliner, I can soften the whole look dengan uh, black eyeshadow. So this is another palette from um, NYX juga, Ultimate Shadow Palette. Tapi ni yang smoky tadi, I guna tu yang, what do you call this? Neutrals. Okay, so kat smoky ni ada this black shade. So I'm going to use that black shade. I'm really tapping it off sebab I tak nak anything to fall on my on my face. You know, you've done so much work, the, le the last thing you want to do is, you know, dropping black shadows on your face. So, I'm just going to go on top of those line yang kita dah buat tadi. And smudge it slightly. Okay. I'm using an angle brush to do this. And nanti akan guna a slightly bigger brush just to smudge further. Ni just to make sure everything is matte. So, siapa-siapa yang tak pandai guna eyeliner pun, you can easily do the step. Sebab kalau eyeliner ni tadi tak kemas pun, now you're blending everything, jadi it really doesn't matter. Then, I'm just gonna, I just nak ambil brush yang uh, slightly fluffy. Same shade. Tapping the excess off. And I'm just going to blend it on top. So immediately, without you even trying hard, 
it will give you a smoky effect Kan, tapi sebab kita guna pinks and light shades So it's not going to be like a really really dark eye look It's going to look really really soft Kalau you nak make it even more softer You could actually use uh, some purple shades to, to smudge it You know just to Just to make it look softer Okay. Alright, so now the same brush, I nak ambil this purple shade sikit. And this brown shade. Really want something in between these two. Can you all see? So this one dengan yang ini. Okay, I dah letak tu and I'm just going to blend kat belakang tangan I to remove most of the products out. Sikit je. Let's focus kat our low, lower lash line. Really don't want much and but I just want some sort of uh, shadow je, tak nak banyak sangat. I'm just going to emphasize the uh, light shade dekat in the corner ni. Really, really does open up your eye punya area. Alright, the same shade, I just nak bawa kat area hidung eye sikit. This is an highlighter. Really will pick up the light nanti. So, a little bit kat sini. So you could really double up your eye eyeshadow sometimes you know as a highlighter. Alright. So next I nak guna mascara now. Um sebab it's a day look, I tak nak pakai lashes and so the only way out is to get a really really high impact mascara. Okay, and I love me some lashes. So this is the False Lash Superstar from L'Oreal. Dia ada step 1 dengan step 2. Oh sorry, step 1 dengan step 2. Step 1 ni what it does, uh, dia akan tambah fiber ke our lashes. So siapa yang tak ada bulu mata banyak sangat, just use this dulu just to create, you know, the impact of like macam you ada banyak lashes. Okay. So I can coat both my upper and lower lashes dengan benda ni. I really want you guys to see the effect out. So it really, really is so effective. The first time I used this, I was sold immediately. Can nampak tak? This is with the coat of uh, white lashes. Can you see how long my lashes look? It really, really does add some fibers. Okay? So this is without anything yet. So I'm going to do one eye so that semua orang boleh tengok effect dia. But jangan overdo this part ya yeah? Sebab kalau, kalau, uh, kalau kita overdo this part Nanti masa kita nak letak the black It's just going to look so clumpy So you know one layer is all you need Because really picks up every uh, hair kat your eye, eyelash Okay next step 2 is to darken everything So now this part will just give you a much more voluminous effect Nampak tak beza with mascara and without mascara. So mascara memang it will make all the you know difference. Just gonna clean up sikit. Just gonna use the uh, cotton buses to blend any sharp edges, kapa. Alright. So this is with mascara and without mascara. So you know I'm completely sold by this. So you guys, kalau nak long lashes without even using um, what do you call this eyelash, try this out. So I hope it's not a slow Wednesday for you anymore. 
Because now you guys are, I hope you guys are entertained with this tutorial, CK. Okay. okay, so this is the uh, white base. Just gonna coat my lashes with the step two. Okay, I actually had a mistake down there. So I can make a mask dengan my Garnier water. Now, do not panic kalau kita, you know, accidentally smudge some mascara ke. Don't panic. Do not you don't have to remove everything. Just get your cotton. Get some micellar water. And erase your mistake and nobody will even know you did that. Okay? So as simple as that. So let's say kalau uh, even dekat tengah-tengah hidung ke apa, kalau you tersmudge some mascara or something, just go in with your Garnier water and wipe it off. Okay? So do not sweat. Okay, next, I nak letak blusher and I really really want my blusher to be uh, quite on your face sikit sebab I love blusher. So this is the NYX punya um, Sweet Cheeks palette. So it has all the shades, one, two, three, four, eight shades in, all right? So it will suit most skin tones. So kalau you darker skin, just mix in the, the you know, the more corally shades in. Uh, if you're lighter skin, then you know, you have the shades. You could use this for darker skin. So, you know, it's really, really a good buy. So I'm just gonna mix in somewhere around this and this. Okay, so a little bit of this and a little bit of this. So now you have plants on your brush, just remove some at the back of your head and then just focus. Now a lot of you will, you know, smile when you nak letak blusher, you really don't need to. Just focus, you know, you got to know where you nak letak and then just really, really blend it in. I hope the camera is picking up how beautiful this blusher is. Okay, sikit je benda ni kat hidung. to tie everything in. No, my tips kalau you just want to make sure everything looks sekata, is take a, you know, just take a blending brush, whatever blusher that you use tadi tu, you know, the same color, so grab some on your blending brush and then just blend the eyeshadow you skip. So in this way you tahu, you know, everything is uh, one tone, you know. So let's say kalau you tak guna uh, blusher and you suka guna contour color ke bronzer ke, just take that bronzer color sikit dekat area mata you sikit. Okay. So we're done with the eyes and the uh, face. Last but not least is lips. Uh, this is the powder matte lipstick from Maybelline and the color is in Touch of Nude. It's about, you know, as I said, this look is all really pinky, really soft. So you, the last thing you, I would want to do to myself is, you know, to use something that's really, really garang, tak nak garang. This is so pigmented, so comfortable on your lips. It does feel a little powdery, tapi dia rasa selesa sangat. Powdery but nice. And you know, as you can see, I've got really, really dry lips at this point, but it doesn't emphasize, which is good. Right, so this is the finale for look one. Uh, my tudung is from Jelita Sara. Now, uh, I think this is why sangat dengan my look juga sebab you know, I've gone for really, really nice pinky look. So this hijab really, really does justice to this look. 
So uh, I hope How long did I take? 20 minutes ada tak? Okay, lebih kurang 20 minutes So kalau you tak menceh-ceh-ceh macam I tadi So perhaps will take you about what 10 minutes, 15 minutes stops uh, So I think senang juga kalau you nak recreate Sebab everything is so simple The products are inexpensive But they really really effective They look really really good And whatever that I use on my skin I make sure it will last throughout the day Sebab you know I don't think so We'll have time to touch up banyak sangat Paling-paling pun lipstick Sebab kita akan makan throughout the day Itu je alright So stay tuned for the second look lepas ni alright So, I dah cuci dah muka I sekarang So, I've removed every single uh, bits of makeup on my skin Sebab I'm gonna now shoot the second look Which is our night look So, night look ni is more, of course, slightly more dramatic So, if you guys are going out You know, you guys gonna have some good times with your family outside So, you know, you might as well have a nice makeup on, alright So, for the second look, I dah apply dah my moisturizer This is the Hydra Fresh The same one that I used tadi Sebab uh, this is so lightweight and it's so moisturizing And then I nak prime my skin Walaupun malam pun I still nak prime my skin Sebab I want the makeup to look really good So this is the um, NYX Studio Photogenic Primer Okay You really need like The tiniest tiniest amount of this Sikit je jangan banyak sangat guys Takut nanti you guys You know Because this thing is quite good It only requires like A small dollop Okay. 
So I'm focusing this mainly to cut my T zone area. Just pushing it into the skin skit. Okay. Alright, next, uh, I not spray my skin skit just to give me some extra bit of moisturization. This is the next dewy finish um, long lasting makeup spray. Now I'm going to use this before and after my makeup uh, routine. So just going to give that a few seconds to dry. Oh yeah, guys. Uh, if, sebelum I lupa uh, Lazada is having a flash sale So uh, from 12pm up to 1pm You know right now So kalau you all nak really really save up Go to Lazada right now They have sales up to 65% So do not miss this chance And jangan lambat Sebab you only have this one hour period to shop Alright so chop chop Go and get your things right now Okay so I think this is settled in. Um, I need to use some foundation. Uh, kali ni, I nak guna the True Match foundation. Now, my shade is in Gold Ivory. They have tons of shades, so you guys could actually use, uh, you know, about 11 shades, I guess. Alright, so you there's a shade for everybody, and it's really inexpensive. You could get it in Lazada, you know. So, right now, there's a flash sale, so why not have a look? Alright, so I nak guna about a pump of this. Right, this is one pump. Color you need more, you could always add in. So start off, you know, with a minimum amount. And same rules apply. Jangan, uh, jangan drag the foundation. Dab the foundation in tau. Okay. So for those of you yang baru join our live, uh, there's a flash sales going on dekat Lazada. So they have uh, sales up to 65%. So the sales will, I think, sampai pukul 1 hari ni kot. So jangan lupa, tune in and shop till you drop. Now how many of you have actually used this foundation? This is really, really such a good foundation. And it happens to be the foundation that I use for myself on a daily basis juga. This is one pump guys, one pump and look at how amazing the coverage is. Okay, as this is a day, uh, night look, sorry, so uh, you could afford to have extra coverage cut your skin. So, but there's no, like we know, there's no really harsh sunlight out there to actually show how bad your makeup is or how good your makeup is. So. Could get away with extra makeup throughout the night. Okay. So uh, as I said, bawah mata kita semua jangan cuba kawal dengan uh, foundation because it's not going to work. So always, always, always go in with a concealer that works better. All right. So the same shade tadi I guna the correcting shade. Just going to correct sikit bawah mata. Now, kalau kita nak guna makeup throughout the day, it's so important for us to moisturize tau. Kalau tak nanti, bawah mata kita akan crease. So, don't blame the concealer if it crease. So, sometimes kalau uh, makeup kita tak tahan ke apa, oftentimes it's the uh, skin care more than the makeup. Okay. So, tadi masa I guna the moisturizer pun, I just took, just carry a little bit of this kat bawah mata. Just... It's not baggy, uh, you know, a little bit of moisturization kat sana. Tapi hidung sikit sebab this is the place that kita selalu akan lupa nak conceal. But nanti throughout the day, mesti dia akan uh, jadi merah-merah. So, that one will just give you an instant tired effect. Now, uh, kalau tak nak guna brush pun tak apa, you boleh guna tangan je untuk blend, like you know, just dab it with your fingers. Cuma I suka guna brush sebab lagi cepat. Okay, normally, I akan guna a mixture of brush dengan beauty blender. 
So kat area mata I pun I conceal sikit sebab uh, I think so obvious that mata I ni uh, dark circles I quite obvious. And lagi-lagi bulan puasa, you know, it's very very common that muka kita, you know, we, we will look dull sebab kita dehydrated kan. Jadi it's so important that kita you know cover up whatever that we need to. Okay? Uh, next, I nak guna concealer. Uh, I'm going to use the A Instant Age Revine Concealer again. So, a little bit heavier than earlier. But nobody's going to notice. Alright. And a little bit here. A little bit here. A little bit here around my chin sides of my mouth okay so next I just now um, blend everything in so masa blend kalau boleh jangan senyum-senyum sebab nanti kan masa kita senyum we are stretching our skin so it's all just going to settle in our uh, fine line so what muka you know just just do quite a serious face blend in now, I know blending is taking so much time guys I pun penat blend tapi sebab nak cantik kan so I know I keep repeating but guys do not forget there's a flash sales you wouldn't want to miss out on that. Just head to Lazada. You know, lazada.com.my. And, yep. The flash will last for only one hour. So, whatever that you tengok I guna hari ni, you could get them uh, during the flash sales. Okay, so dah buat ni. I kena set everything that I dah apply sebab I tak nak apa-apa gerak pada muka I. So, just taking a very small brush and some powder. So, this powder is the Maybelline uh, punya Dream Satin uh, powder. Memang bagus. It's so smooth. I really don't want to apply too much of this. Sikit je. Dia bagi sponge pun tau. So, kalau let's say tak ada brush, just ambil sponge dia. Just letak sikit and then just dab it in. Dab macam tu je. Jangan dab banyak sangat. Jangan ambil banyak sangat sebab you tak nak nampak keki. Tapi I lagi prefer using um, brush sebab I can control mana I nak letak. Let's say I nak letak sini, I can just control kat sana je. Bawah mata pun I can just easily control. And with brush, you can uh, pick up less. Okay? So next, uh, I nak put back my dimensions in sebab as usual lah kan sebab kita dah letak foundation and all that so tak nak lah bagi nampak I want the skin to have some dimension so I can guna the NYX punya highlight and contour pro palette now kalau you are makeup artist ke atau you are baru nak start in makeup this is such a good palette to invest guys sebab dia ada semua shade ni jadi let's say kalau you tak tahu contour shade you yang mana satu you could easily just mix any of this shade kat bawah just to sculpt your cheeks or let's say if even you could even use this as a setting powder so it's such a good investment kalau makeup artist lagi senang sebab you can just bring this satu palette ni je cukup untuk semua your brights alright so for this, I nak ambil brush yang kecil sikit so that I can focus on my, you know, my hollows. So untuk kulit I, colour ni paling sesuai. Sebab dia tak gelap sangat and dia tak uh, warm sangat. It's quite cool. So get some on your brush. Now, um, macam tadi kita buat kan, kita kena suck the cheeks in. So the same thing applies. Suck your cheeks in really, really well. And I follow wherever that, you know, your skin curves in nampak tak and I buat sebelah je so that you all boleh tengok beza dia ya yeah? uh, as this is a uh, night look so I can afford to go a bit heavy kalau day look janganlah buat heavy macam ni nanti kan obvious sangat kan 
Nak buat heavy tak apa Tapi make sure kita blend betul-betul Kadang-kadang orang buat contour Tapi tak blend So it's just gonna give you like A stripe je Nanti korang akan nampak obvious Dalam gambar semua Especially in flash photography So sikit kat area uh, Dahi eye Kalau you think you've overdone it ke apa Just, just dab it back with your beauty blender And just remove whatever extra that you've done So nampak tak beza Kiri dengan kanan Alright, so yang ini ada contour So it looks much more sculpted Yang ini I tak contour lagi Nampak tak? Alright, so sculpting is so important guys It really really will bring back your cheekbones So kalau masa raya siapa yang termakan banyak tu This is such a good step for you guys juga Alright, so now I'm just going to continue on the other cheeks So always check back ya, yeah? mesti dia kena sama tempat. So the same uh, color I nak letak dekat my double chin. Siapa yang tak ada double chin, lucky you. Siapa yang ada, jangan lupa follow the step. Okay, so sekarang ni I think my cheeks are looking much more desirable uh, I need to make my nose look desirable sekarang So uh, the same shade apa yang I guna tadi but now with a smaller brush uh, I'm just going to contour my nose sikit So just get some Nah, Daripada kening kita sampai ke bawah Just shade that area So you don't need to do plastic surgery guys Guna contour je I tak blend apa-apa lagi So it may look really harsh sekarang ni But I really want you guys to see the impact You know on you know What difference contour can make Nampak tak beza? Can you guys see? Alright So let's say kalau kita rasa macam kita overdo the contour ke apa Beauty blender, blend everything Okay Alright, so lepas kita dah contour It's so important to highlight Sebab kita dah recite whatever yang kita tak nak Sekarang ni kita kena highlight apa yang kita nak bagi nampak lagi obvious So uh, this is the master strobing stick Now You know, orang selalu kata jangan guna uh, creamy products atas powdered skin But this product is so cool Sebab it really works both on dry skin or you know moisturized skin So tak payah nak risau sangat You could just use this on top and just blend So wherever yang kita tak letak kita punya contour tadi atas dia kan So kita blend ni sikit So what it does is Dia akan bagi nampak the contour more prominent Nampak tak? So ini I tak letak, ini I letak So yang ini akan nampak lagi prominent the contour Sebab I've highlighted the part above Jadi the contour is going to look more deeper So for those of you with darker skin uh, I would suggest daripada you all buat more contouring You guys would uh, might want to highlight more So naturally once you dah highlight your skin The other parts of your skin akan nampak slightly more slender So a little bit just cut the tips of your nose has like really micro shimmer in so it really picks up the light really beautifully okay then blend everything in apa pun kita dah apply macam mana pun kita kena blend tau so, nanti kalau kita tak blend it's going to be very obvious in the photos nanti okay so next i nak uh, buat brows dulu just to have a rough idea on how my you know just to give Because I'm sculpting my whole face right now So it's so important that I do my brows juga Because brows will really frame your whole face Right 
so this is the um, brow artist from L'Oreal so this is the pencil on one side and the other side ada spoolie kalau tak ada spoolie it's so difficult to do brows kan sebab spoolie is so important to actually brush and soften all the harsh uh, lines okay so just use the uh, the pencil first to draw dulu So I'm just going to draw the bottom part first just to give a good idea, alright? So, and then, um, oh, this is actually mechanical, uh, so you tak payah nak, apa ni, uh, the, you don't have to sharp ke apa, alright? You guys see? Me, this is done and this is undone. Alright? So really, really, it's so fast guys. Kejap je nak buat ni. Alright, and then kita akan guna the spoolie side just to blend everything in. Right, so benda ni dekat tengah-tengah ada bedak pun tau so kalau kita dah color in just immediately just use the sponge tip so benda ni it's a three way thing alright just guna the middle part of it and just color in dekat tengah-tengah alright so you don't have to use a powder a brush and a, a pencil everything is in one so senang sangat so kalau you are on a rush in the morning couple this is such a easiest this is the easiest product that you could use all right and as usual i can conceal wherever yang you know i have extra stray hairs so macam tadi lah kita guna our uh, age rewind concealer tu sikit Let's clean up kat bawah ni all right so can you see immediately it looks like macam i did I did some brow job or something. All right. Okay. So I'm just going to repeat the same step. So first, use the pencil side first. Guys, siapa yang baru masuk, jangan lupa kita ada flash sale sekarang. So, from 12pm to 1pm dekat lazada.com.my. So, they have sales up to 65% guys. So, do not miss that out. Okay, kita dah color in. So, sekarang ni, uh, we're just going to brush everything up. Alright, and then sekarang ni we're just gonna use the powder kat tengah-tengah ni and color in whatever, where I know, just fill in the brows. Senang kan? Then last but not least, kita kena uh, conceal wherever we have stray hairs. Masalah blend ni, saya guna tangan je tau. Tak payah guna brush semua. Senang je kita guna tangan kan? Okay guys. Alright, so next, I nak buat uh, eyeshadow. Tapi sebelum I nak letak eyeshadow, I nak I, I, I want my eyeshadows to last throughout the day. So, it's so important that I use a primer. Now, this is a NYX punya glitter primer. 
it is called glitter primer so let's say kalau you nak letak glitter ke apa just use this first pasal baru letak glitter but it also doubles up as a normal eyeshadow primer just a little bit of this sikit je and then just you know spread it at both your fingers letak sikit and then blend So it's so sticky, that means it's really, really going to grip every single shadows on very well. Okay, but lepas kita dah letak ni, it's so crucial that kita uh, blend some powder in dulu sebab kita tak nak eyeshadow kita go patchy. Just blend some powder in. Okay, alright. So now untuk this look, uh, slightly heavier, so I nak guna... Oh, I love this product. This is from uh, L'Oreal and it's, this is called the Super Liner Superstar Duo Designer. So, on one end, there are the pencil yang gel and on the other end, there are the liquid liner. Alright, so I think semua orang tahu kot L'Oreal punya eyeliners are one of the best out there. Even I use it every day myself. So, I'm going to use this sikit dekat my waterline, okay? So to, to do your waterline, I'm just going to use your uh, pinky finger, tarik sikit mata and just colour that in. Okay. Immediately, can you see how much smoky my eyes look right now? Okay, so the same colour, I just nak apply ke atas sikit. Kalau dia messy pun tak apa sebab this is just like a base for our darker shades. And blend dengan tangan je. Okay. Blend sikit kat bawah mata. Alright, and then just look at it. And just blend. Okay. I'm not going to use any eyeshadow pun lagi, tapi dah nampak macam, you know, dah nampak smoky. Alright. So next, I nak letak eyeshadow. Uh, I nak guna this palette lah. This is called the Rock Rock Nudes from Maybelline. Okay, so what? Yeah, oh, okay, I love this color. Should I use this? I think I really want to use that cantiknya color too. I'm just going to take this color on a flat shader brush. Drop off whatever that you know you don't need. Supply. Oh, I love this color. Such a beautiful color. The me go lawa sangat. And so, but I let glitter primer tadi, so all the uh, glitter dalam shadow ni pun is picking up. In fact, you could just use your fingers with this. Spread it in. When you pat dengan your fingers, the glitter lagi lagi nampak obvious. You'll see. Cantiknya color dia. I love the color. Alright, then from the same palette, just I'm just using the purple shade to see it. Just nak nak uh, scalp the eyes. So we're not carry the shadow too far out. Sikit je macam tu. Can you all see? I'm just using my fingers, picking up that greeny shade and just patting it on my eyelid. So I'm not even doing much. 
We don't really need any skills for this guy. It's so simple. Cintu je. Alright. And then uh just wipe up my hands, but tak nak pegang. Right? Alright, then using the uh purple shade, sikit just nak scalp the eyes. As simple as that. It's not this is like literally like 5 minutes I make up. Good job, je. And I'm just using the same shade at bawah mata sikit. It's not bagi that smokiness. Alright. Okay. So next I akan uh, letak mascara. This is the uh, false lashes, false lashes, the falsies push up drama. Okay, I pernah guna mascara ni sebelum ni. Memang it really really does give you the falsies effect. I ada bawa lashes, tapi I rasa tak ya pakai lashes pun. Kau just use the mascara, it will actually do justice. Alright guys, jangan lupa as I said, as I mentioned earlier, for those of you yang baru masuk, uh, kita ada flash sale sekarang dekat lazada.com.my. So if you uh, you know, if you surf their website sekarang lazada.com.my, you will get you apa apa you beli, they have sales up to 65%. So you wouldn't want to miss this chance. So whatever that you see me using today, insyaallah you can buy it there also. I'm just going to do one eye so that semua orang boleh tengok efek mascara ni. And how many of you actually have problems with mascara? Where your mascara doesn't last? Or the mascara cepat cair? Well, I'm one of them. I selalu ada mascara cair punya problem. But with this, it really, really lasts. Memang tak pernah ada masalah macam tu sebelum ni. Nampak tak? Okay. So I'm just going to continue for the other eyes. So normally kan kalau I nak guna kalau I want really really uh you know lots of lashes I can guna the tip of the mascara punya brush and pull in so what this will do is that it will you know coat individual lashes and then I'll pull everything up together That's like the eyes done. Sekejap je kan, tak lama pun. Alright, let's say kalau you nak highlight your inner corner, boleh je. I'm just going to use this pink shade sikit. This is a brush that comes with the palette. So I'm just going to take the brush and that pink shade sikit. And just highlight kat uh, inner corner eye sikit. Okay, alright. Okay, so now uh, I nak buat blusher pula. For blusher, I nak guna the same palette yang I guna tadi, the Sweet Cheeks. Because I really like this palette, senang sangat. Alright, so uh, tadi I guna more like pinky-pinky shade. Sekarang ni sebab it's much more sultry and stuff. I want to use the more peachy and coral shade. Some of my brush, and let's remove it kat tangan sikit. So now I did the contour. So you want to put your blusher above your contour line, okay? So it's supposed to be in between your highlight and your contour. Now 
a little bit get your tip of your nose. Alright. Okay. So next, I nak buat lips. Uh, for lips, actually I have a really really cool product here. This is the L'Oreal punya lipsticks. Um, the color that I really Tadi saya tengah pandang is this gold. I'm so intrigued to use this gold color. So uh, untuk lipstick, I might want to try that color. This is the collection star from L'Oreal Paris, and the color is Saint Le Gold. Okay. So tadi masa saya tengok color ni pun, I was so intrigued to use. It's like a really nice goldy shade. So you could actually use it on its own, atau use it on top of any lipstick that you dah ada. So tadi kan, I dah guna the uh, powder powder matte lipstick from Maybelline. So I'm just going to use this again just to see whether this two is a good pair or not. Okay, let's try. So this is just my base, you know, whatever color yang kita guna tadi. Sikit je, I just want to see how it looks. Alright, so this is whatever that we use tadi, cantik. Tapi I nak guna another color which is the gold. See how it looks. This is my first time wearing, so I don't know how it's going to look. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Love the color. Immediately, it's like giving a whole new look. This is like uh, pink. Ada letak ni je, it looks so much more coral, slightly goldy. Now used to, this colour memang uh, sangat rare, tak pernah lagi I tengok other brands with this kind of uh, concept. Such a nice colour. So you could use this on any lipstick dah, yang you dah pernah ada pun, tak payah nak beli lipstick baru for this. Such a beautiful shade guys. Love the colour. So this is from L'Oreal again, siapa nak beli? Really, I'm so recommending this product. Such a beautiful product. Alright, so the habis lipstick. I now apply some uh, setting spray just to set everything. The same setting spray yang I guna tadi, the NYX punya. NYX ada dua tau. Dia ada yang uh, dewy finish dengan matte finish. Tapi I got dry skin so always go for the dewy finish. Alright, okay, so this is my final look for our Raya look uh, night time. Alright, so last but not least, just to point it out there, we have a flash sales going on from 12 pm up to 1 pm. So, we're gonna end up and anytime right now. So, please chap chap, go to lazada.com.my, shop till you drop, and stay tuned for our next uh, live tutorial video in Lazada TV. Alright, so see you guys. Assalamualaikum.